Welcome to Brit Lab, where today we're giving you the lowdown on how to avoid food poisoning from reheating leftovers. <sighs> if, like me, you have a tendency to overorder when it comes to takeaways, at the end of the meal you're faced with the dilemma. Do you chuck it out, it seems a shame, or do you reheat it? The problem is, with reheating, you might get food poisoning, like a million Britons do every year. So what are the rules around reheating food? According to the Food Standards Agency, you shouldn't reheat leftover takeaways more than once. But in reality, if we heat our food up really thoroughly and kill all the bacteria, we should be making it safe to eat again. Though admittedly, you're probably not going to make it any more appetising by continually zapping the bacteria to death. But you need to be sure, especially when you're using a microwave to reheat, that it's all been cooked properly. OK, that's done. It feels nice and warm. But how do you tell it's been heated all the way through? Well, obviously, what you do is use one of these, which I happen to have, a nice thermal camera. You can see kind of the red zones and the blue zones. Well, the blue zones are where it's still cold. The red zones are fine, bacteria all killed, but the blue zones Plenty of bacteria still thriving, so uh, I think this one needs to go back in the microwave for a few more minutes. You should aim to get your food to 82 degrees Celsius, all the way through to be safe. If you use a microwave, you need to make sure to stir it and then re-zap it at least once until it's piping hot all the way through. Okay, so that looks hot enough. Mainly red, the blue bits are all around the rim, everything else is sort of red or yellow. So uh, I think that's ready to eat. But there is one exception that no amount of reheating will make safe to eat. Rice. Rice can sometimes get infected with bacteria called Bacillus cereus. And these bacteria in turn produce toxins which cause diarrhea and vomiting. The thing is, these toxins are also heat stable, which means that even if you warm up the rice and kill the bacteria, the toxins will still be there. It's important once your rice is cooled to put it in the fridge straight away and then only reheat it once, otherwise you really are playing Russian roulette with your guts. Sorry Terry. No, I can take your picture. How about that? Do please leave your comments below and remember, for more science ideas and tips, subscribe to BritLab.